The REG's Kwametra Olborn has been out all morning long following this story. Kwametra, we understand so much more information has come out in just the past hour or so. Police telling you this all started when the man got home from work? Absolutely. There's a lot to unpack here, but for the first time, we are getting a look at the apartment complex where this incident took place. This is the Summer Hill Apartments. And like you said, this all started according to Memphis police when the suspect got off work around 1120 last night. And according to Memphis police, the suspect had made threats towards his roommates. Now, when they arrived, those roommates were able to get out unharmed. Just listen, just listen to what police say these roommates had to do just to get out safely. One was in the garage when it happened, so he was able to run out. The other ones had to kind of scale the wall to the other side to another apartment, to, and we provided them for ladders so they can come down once he got to the other side to a point of safety. In a very situation for the roommates, and again, both of them were not injured in this encounter. But Memphis police say when they got on scene, it was nearly 12 hours of negotiation before they were able to take the suspect into custody peacefully. Again, the suspect was able to go into custody without incident. Now, during this time, during those 12 hours, police tell us that this suspect fired shots at officers multiple times throughout the night, up to six different incidents did this suspect fire shots at officers, but Memphis police say they did not return fire even when one of their own was injured during that encounter. But like you said, that officer was taken to the hospital and is expected to be OK. Now we asked Memphis, Memphis police for a motive as to why this person did this or why they threatened uh, their roommates and police at this time have not released that motive. But again, this is on Summer Avenue. This road was blocked off for, like I said, nearly 12 hours hours. In fact, the people who live inside of this apartment complex were told to shelter in place. They were told to not send their kids to school because again, this was a very active scene where you had a suspect who, according to Memphis police, were firing multiple shots at officers. So for safety, they told everyone to shelter in place. But we do know at a certain point, residents were evacuated from the property. But like I said, they were able to safely and peacefully remove the suspect from the home, from the unit. This happened on the 6100 block of Aston over here at the Summer Hill Apartments. Uh, and again, that person was taken into custody. Now at this time, police Police have not released the suspect's identity and they have not said what charges this person may be facing. So still a very developing story. As you can see, the scene is still very active, uh, but we're going to stay on top of it. We're going to keep asking Memphis police for more information. And as soon as we learn the identity of the suspect and the charges they're facing, we'll make sure to let you know. Reporting live, Commissioner Wilborn, WREG, News Channel 3.